This is a recipe for my absolute favorite thing in the world to eat, the American cheeseburger. It's this beautiful stack of double patty beef and American cheese and squishy bun. To me, this is what a cheeseburger should be. First, the meat. I like to use a combination of chuck and flank. But one of the secrets is this, ground bacon. And I came up with this idea because I love a bacon cheeseburger, but I hate fighting with the strips of bacon. So I decided to put it into the meat, just like that. You can see the streaks of bacon in the meat. You have this beautiful bacon and beef mixture now. So we'll make some thin patties. And I like a double patty burger. That's really important to me. The American cheese kind of melts in between and becomes one, just like that. So now we have these patties out. It's time to cook them. For me, it's very, very important to use high heat. So here's where a lot of people really mess up. They want to start messing with this and fidgeting around and flipping it, but you have to let it do its thing. You have to let it sit there and form this beautiful crust because that's where a ton of the flavor comes from. And the bun is also very, very important. I prefer like a potato roll or a brioche type thing, something that's nice and buttery. And I like to grab some of those juices from the burger. So I'll show you that color and sear. Once that happens, everything happens very, very quickly. So you have to have all of your stuff laid out, ready to go. You don't want to be running to the fridge and trying to find the American cheese when the burger's perfectly cooked. These are white onions that are shaved pretty thin. I like how they kind of hide underneath the cheese and the thinness kind of allows them to cook quickly. To me, this is something that's very important about an American cheeseburger, and that's American cheese. This cheese has this magical effect of melting on a burger like this, especially a double patty burger, and it almost becomes the sauce. You can only get that from American cheese. So once that's nice and brown, I like to slather some of our secret hamburger sauce, this mixture of ketchup and mayonnaise and mustard and pickles. I like to put it on both sides of the bun. And then I use bread and butter pickles. See now, that American cheese is just like melting and oozing and dripping. And to me, that is just amazing. That's what an American cheeseburger should look like in my opinion. That thing smells amazing. That burger should be a little messy. Should drip and ooze like that. Man, cheeseburgers are awesome. Ha, ha, ha.